The Turner Prize jury looks at exhibitions over a year-long period, um, and they and they select artists that felt that they had an incredible contribution in that year. Paul Noble has been selected for his exhibition, for his solo exhibition at um, the Gagosian Gallery last year. I think the judges really appreciated the magnitude of his project, um, an ongoing drawing project that's been um, going on since 16 years now. I really like the intricacy of the drawings um, and he's, he, he's drawing, um, he's, he treats them as giant miniatures as you would start drawing on a very small bit of the paper and, and then expand into this kind of completely monumental drawings. Um, and uh, obviously Paul's exhibition at uh, the Kagosian Gallery was um, a really amazing show that they felt it should be acknowledged and included in the shortlist this year. Luke Fowler was nominated for his um, uh, incredible film All Divided Selves that was shown at Ivanley House in Edinburgh. Um, and the film is a really um, captivating film, filmic portrait of psychiatrist R.D. Lang. And he has this incredible um, uh, combination of archival footage, really fascinating material that hasn't been seen before, um, along filmic notes of his own life. So he brings everything together in a really compelling edit. Um, Elizabeth Price has been nominated for her film The Woolworth Choir or 1979 um, and she has combined a lot of um, archival footage from, new, from the news um, and a lot of um, other social references such as architectural elements from the church um, uh, and she has merged everything together to create a video that drifts between fantasy and reality. Spartacus Chetwing has been nominated for her exhibition The Old Man Out um, at Sadie Cole's gallery last year and she has transformed the gallery space into a carnivalesque setting to host daily live performances that include a puppet show and an oracle that offers uh, personal readings to the visitors of their future.